Hello learners! This is Teacher Jai and welcome to our English class. Today we are going to learn about classifying, categorizing sounds heard from animals, mechanical objects, musical instruments, and environmental sounds. Or classification of loud and soft sound. Now, I want you to prepare your self-learning module, your English notebook, and your pencil for we will answer this module together and I am so excited to guide you and help you understand our lesson this morning. You just need to listen to me until the end of this video and together we will enjoy all the activities and exercises we have here. Remember, do not write anything on your module and be sure to write your answers on your English notebook for that will serve as your accomplishment in English too. Are you excited? That's great! Now open your module to page 1 and let's answer the pretest. Directions Look at the following pictures and try to produce their sounds. And I will give you 20 seconds to answer and your timer starts now. The first picture is a snake and the snake sounds very good. Now how about the second picture? The second picture is a clap and the clap sounds that's great. Now the next picture yes it's a train and the train sounds very good. Now how about this next picture? Yes, it's a drum and the drum sounds very good. Now look at this next picture. Yes, it's a cat and the cat sounds very good. Now let's go over with the last picture. Yes, it's an ambulance and the ambulance sounds very good. Did you get the perfect score? That's great, kids! Now we're done answering our pretest. This time, open your module to page 2. Remember, different animals produce different sounds. It could be loud or soft. Example of an animal that has loud sound is... Yes, dog. Next, example of an animal that has soft sound is... A bird. Also, musical instruments have different sounds. Some musical instruments produce loud or soft sound. Example of an instrument that has loud sound is very good. Now, example of an instrument that has soft sound is that's great. Now, sounds in the environment and transportation differ from one another. They can be loud or soft sound. Example of a loud sound is... Very good. Now, we'll give you an example of a soft sound. Yes, very good. Now, let's move on to our next activity. Name the musical instruments and draw them in your notebook. First picture. Second. Third. And fourth. I will give you 20 seconds to answer and your timer starts now. Now 
let's try to check your answer. The first picture is... Very good, it's a guitar. The second picture is... That's great, it's a drum. The third picture... Yes, it's a violin. And the last picture is... Xylophone. Did you get the perfect score? That's great! This time, number your notebook from 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Are you done? Now let us identify the objects and animals make a loud or soft sound. Write L for loud sound and S for soft sound. Number 1, bed. Number two, cat. Number three, ambulance. Number four, watch. Number five, dog. Now I will give you 10 seconds to answer and your timer starts now. Now let's check your answer. Number one, bell. The bell has loud sound. And the answer is L. Number two, cat. The cat has loud sound. And the answer is L. Number three, ambulance. The ambulance has loud sound and the answer is L number four watch the watch has soft sound and the answer is S and number five dog and the dog has loud sound the answer is L now did you get all of these correct answers if you do that's great. Now let's move on to guided activity one. Which of the following produce animal sound? Write their names in your notebook. Now we'll give you 10 seconds to answer and your timer starts now. Guided Activity 2. Which of the following means of transportation produce loud sounds? Write their names in your notebook. Now I will give you 10 seconds to answer and your timer starts now. Did you get all these correct answers? If you do, you did a good job. Let's move on to our guided activity three. Write the things in the environment that make sounds and write your answers in your notebook. Now we'll give you 10 seconds to answer and your timer starts now. Did you get all these correct answers? If you do, you did an excellent job. And for our next activity, put a cross if the sound is made by an animal. And check if the sound is made by a thing. Write your answers in your notebook. And I will give you 20 seconds to answer and your timer starts now.
Did you get all these correct answers? If you do, you did an excellent job. This time, let's have a quiz. Are you ready, kids? Now identify the kind of sounds given below. Write your answers in your notebook. And for this test, I will give you one minute to answer. When your timer starts, now. Number one, soft. Number two, loud. Number three, loud. Number four, soft. Number five, soft. Now let's look at the answers here. Did you get the perfect score? If you do, you did a great job. Remember, all sounds come from vibrating objects. Sound may come from animals, mechanical objects, musical instruments, and environmental sounds. Loud sounds are powerful sounds that are high volume. And soft sounds are gentle sounds that are low volume. Now let us see how far you have learned about our lesson today. First, you draw an animal that makes loud sound. Second, draw an object that makes soft sound. Third, you need to draw an object in the environment that makes soft sound. And lastly, Draw a kind of transportation that makes loud sound. For this activity, I will give you one minute to answer. And your timer starts now. Are you done? That's great. This time, let's have a quiz. Are you ready, kids? Now identify the kind of sounds given below. Write your answers in your notebook. And for this test, I will give you one minute to answer. When your timer starts, now.
answers. Number one, soft. Number two, loud. Number three, loud. Number four, soft. Number five, soft. For your last activity, draw a musical instrument you like to play and write what sound it makes. That ends our lesson today and I am so happy that you reached this far. Thank you for listening and see you next time. Bye-bye!